Welcome back to my YouTube tutorials. This is ABM Graphics. Yes, on this particular tutorial, we are going to learn how to design a political flyer like this. Now, let us go to our Photoshop just like this. So, I have launched my Photoshop just like this. The first thing I'm going to do is to create the document size that I wish to use for this particular distance. So, I'm just going to click on new file where I'll change uh, this uh, settings pixels to what two inches. And then over here, I'll have a nine and I'll have here 10. That looks so cool. Or I can decide to use 10 by 12, it's okay. But if I use something like this, it looks cool for me again to you get that yes so i'm just going to use 9 by 10 to design that particular flyer and then the next thing i'm going to do is to open up my resources file there is the resources file that i'm going to use on this particular uh, tutorial you get that yes so let me on up this let me open this particular this and that is the uh, write up that's supposed to be in this particular flyer you get that yes and there is the image and there is related images that i want to feature in, in this flyer so the next thing i'm going to do is to come over here just like that so the next thing i'm going to do is to create a background for that so i'm just going to click on shape then i'll go to rectangular shape over here then i'm just going to draw something like this over here exactly so this looks so cool for me and the next thing again i'm going to do over here is that i'm just going to change the color to this particular color over here that is green and that is okay so this is uh this particular flyer is just going to base on ndc colors because this particular distance is uh ndc flyer that i'm going to do you get that yes so after having something like this over there the next thing again i'm going to do over here is that i'm just going to have it just like that but i'll hold control and one this side the right side the right corner of here then i'll just move it to somewhere like this then i'll have something like you know sorry i'll move it somewhere here that will be okay for me and then i'll i just want to tilt it so that i'll have it just something like this over there okay so i'll have it somewhere like this i'm dragging the sideways whilst holding control so i'll just have it just like that while holding the mic control yes just to uh adjust it on how i want it so it's something like this okay then i'll click okay just like that then i'll duplicate it by right clicking then click duplicate layer just like that okay so the down fly the down layer over here i'll click on this thumbnail and then change the color to red that looks cool, so cool then i'll move it down just like that okay that's so cool and over here i'll just tilt it a little bit just like that then i'll try and adjust it some way like this okay then i'll move this one a little bit here okay it's okay you get that so this way is cool for me you get that so the next thing i'm going to do is to open up my right up over here then over here i'm just going to copy this particular uh this thing over here national democratic then i'll copy that one then I'll just come and paste it over here, just like that. You get that? Yes, that looks so cool. So I'm just going to reduce the size a little bit down over there so that it will show up that much. So something like this is okay. And I'll make sure is I use bold, yes, yeah, so that it will appear well for me. You get that? So this way is cool. So the next thing again I'm going to do is go to my file. Then I'll come to place a link. Then I'll look for a distant ndc logo that i wish to use so and this logo too is here yes so i'll just import it and then i'll resize it down then i'll move it sorry then i'll move it to somewhere here to get in line with the right up over here you get that yes so i'm just going to move it a little bit here then i'll have it just like that you get that yes so the next thing i'm going to do i'm going to do is to click on my shape and i'll pick the rectangular tool then i'll just draw something like this that looks so cool and then i'll change the color to white this way it's okay then i'll move it down then on the shape i'll right click and create a clipping mask on just like that 
and then i'll zoom out to get my work very well just like that this way is cool then i'll have it just like it it's okay for me then on this particular design i'm just going to right click on that layer that shape layer then i'll duplicate it again and then the down layer over here so let's clip in on on this particular layer i'll just try and move it out a little bit not that much and then i'll change the field to none then a stroke i'll give it a stroke and then a stroke i'll give it somewhere three okay i think three is okay but let me use five okay five is okay then i'll have it just like that you get that so i'll have something like this over there then on the logo i'm just going to group it down just like that then i'll call it logo that looks so cool so as you are doing always organize your layers so that you won't have any problem so let's first of all let's click on the, sh the text then we have our alignment we have a good alignment over here then you can zoom out and then try and move in your distance okay just to have a good uh a good distance over here you get that yes so let's see okay let's see over here okay so this is cool so this it has been aligned with this and it's so cool you get that so after having after having after write up after doing all this it's now cool so the next thing again i'm going to do is to come and pick this particular this thing over here yes then i'll copy it that one too and then i'll come and place it over here they will paste it over here just like that okay that looks so cool and then i'll change my paragraph one to be sected just like that sected it should be sected just like that okay you get that and then over here i'm just going to highlight only the in collaboration with and then with that one i'll come back to my characters layer panel then i'll change it to what the regular so that the it will be that bold you get that so that one is okay for me over there too and the next thing again i'm going to do over here is to pick up presence and then i'll paste it just like that so when you look at the layout is it is going to be cool you get that then you can zoom out then over there i'll try and change um i'll try and change the the, the, the what is the name the font name to either this kind of uh, 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 uh italic or calligraphy this thing you get that yes so let me just check through to see which font will be okay then let's let's use this font uh black swan is okay then i'll put it somewhere there that's all that look cool then over there i'll come and pick campus uh conversation then i'll pick that one then I'll come on again and then I'll paste it over here just like that. And then on that, I'll change the font to Chilex. Chilex is cool. That is what they normally use, this particular font, Chilex. You get that. Then I'll have it just like that. Then I'll change the regular to bold so that it will be somehow bolder. You get that. Looks so cool. So, and then I'll come and pick with jane nana or poku so with this i'm just going to first i'm going to pick with because i want to have some kind of uh right up there that will be okay and then i'll come and pick jane just like that then i'll come and paste it over here and then the last thing i'll pick nana or poku as a man just like that copy it and then i'll paste it just like this you get that yes so the first thing i'm going to do is to work on this j nana so the j nana i'm going to change the font to pacific pacifico so pacifico is the font that they normally use with uh write up for your mama and Jay Nana. So I'm just going to use this 
so i'll increase the size a little bit okay let me use somewhere 120 okay 120 is okay so i'll have that one just like that and then the width i'll try and make the width come somewhere here looks so cool and then the this one the nana i'm just going to reduce the size a little bit to be somewhere here but however i'll change the to 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 all caps all caps is okay and then i'm just going to change the font uh so that uh to okay let me use poppins Poppins is okay, bold poppins. Then I will increase the size a little bit. Okay, let me increase the size a little bit. So let me try and move it out just like that. Okay, yes. So with this, I think having something like this is okay. So I'll have it just like that. And with that, I'll just group that one too. Then I'll call it Jane so that uh, then I'll have it somewhere like this. That looks so cool. You get that yes so the next thing again i'm going to do over here is to pick up dates so i'm just going to pick up dates over here copy then i'll paste the dates over here just like that let me change the color so that it will appear okay then i'll pick a shape over here a rectangular shape right here and i'll just draw something like this over there all right then i'll curve the edges a little bit just like that you get that then i'll move it down then i'll change the date color to white the text to white you get that it looks so cool and then i'll come up and pick the date that will be set day copy and then do what then paste this is just for tutorial sake it's not anything uh serious it's just for tutorial sake then i'll have it just like that and then i'll change the paragraph on to left aligned just like that okay then i'll try and reduce the size a little bit down so that it will be that big you get that and this looks so okay then i'll copy it the same thing down here just like that and then on this one, I'm just going to change it to Venom. Venom. Then I'll, let me reduce the size a little bit. Okay. It's okay. Then I'll come and pick up the Venom. Akena Hotel. Then over this particular distance, I'm just going to paste it over there, just like that. Then I can have it just like this. You get that. Yes, it looks so cool. So the next thing again I'm going to do is to pick up this particular name. That's uh the National Youth Organizer name. So before I do that, let's let me go to file. Now I'll come to place a link. Then I'll search for his uh image, which is here. This I'm just going to use this. There is one thing that I have not done, but let us finish with this before we can talk about that yes so let's have something like this okay it look cool it looks so beautiful yes having this so the next thing again i'm going to do over here is that i'm just going to pick a shape over here then i'll draw something like this over here you get that yes then with that one i'll use the color green over there then it should be somewhere here just like that okay yes and then i'll paste in his name that's george uh george or pay what i do then i'll have something like this you get that then i'll come over and pick the position national youth organizer then i can paste it down here then i'll change it to what to regular and then i'll use this Then i'll increase the size a little bit okay let me use somewhere 24 24 is too much so let me just use 22 
okay so i think 22 is okay it should be somewhere like this and then this should cover up this okay then this is okay then i can now try and move it a little bit not to be too big over there you get that so i can have something like this then i'll just adjust it to the middle that'll be okay you get that yes so this looks so cool so the next thing again i'm going to do over here is that i am just going to pick this or uh, plus this that's the date and the venue and move it to somewhere like this move move it somewhere here then let me just group it it's okay then i'll import in another this thing over here that is the 24 24 hours economy logo plus john mama plus the uh bold the ghana we want logo so all of them i'll just try and let it come somewhere here looks cool you get that yes so with this um i think we have just getting to the end of this particular tutorial so with this i'll try and tilt it a little bit move it somewhere like this you get that yes then i'll move this one a little bit it shouldn't come bigger like this then i'll try and move this one a little bit then i'll just adjust it to my like you get that yes so the gene i can place it somewhere here that looks so cool you get that so with this it's cool then this or uh, plus this i'll move that one to be aligned to this you get that yes yeah, so this looks so cool so with this is okay but on this particular distance i'm just going to add uh their background to it which is this this is the background they normally use so i'm just going to add it to the green layer so there is it i'll right click then create a clip mask on then i'll change it to multiple then i'll reduce the opacity down there you get that i'm just going to reduce the opacity to somewhere 20 to 22 that will be okay then i can have it just like that and with this we are done with the political flyer so we can now do what we can now save our work just like that okay something like this so we have done with the flyer design with uh this particular distance so with this we use red and green and then the white too is part of their colors green is part of their colors red is part of their colors and it looks so beautiful thank you very much for watching this is abian graphics have a nice day